Tonight, D.C. Mayor Muriel Bowser spoke with community members in Southwest, and the mayor was there to address topics ranging from affordable housing to transportation. Fox 5's Sierra Fox was there asking questions about one of the principal issues, which include crime. I did a one on one interview with Mayor Muriel Bowser. I said, Look, you're a public official, but first and foremost, you're a human with emotions. When you hear about the violence happening in Washington, D.C., how does it make you feel? Here's her response. We're very focused on, on safety for every person who lives here and visits here. So any crime in the district is disturbing. I know typically the answer is violent crime is down and you're working to get guns off the street, but residents here don't feel safe a lot of time. They're reaching out to us saying that they feel that crime is out of control. What specifically is being done to address that? We're out in communities every day talking about safety and how our officers can be supportive in neighborhoods that are experiencing high levels of crime. Um, but we also need the community support. Uh, we need to know where the guns are. Uh, and we need to know when they have information about a shooting, how we get dangerous people off the streets. Is there anything you think the police department or your office could do better? We are all focused on public safety. However, it was a violent weekend here in the nation's capital. Sunday afternoon, four men were shot on MLK Jr. and Malcolm X Avenue. Police say the suspect had an AR-15 sticking out of the window of a black car. On Saturday night, a boy and girl were shot on 20th Street in Northeast, not too far from RFK Stadium. Both were taken to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. And Friday, a 31-year-old woman was stabbed to death inside the Ivy City Hotel on New York Avenue in Northwest. A man was shot and killed on Kearney and 16th Streets in Northeast. D.C. crime statistics show homicides are up 30 percent this year compared to the same time last year. And assaults with a dangerous weapon have gone up by 228 citywide during the past two years when compared to the previous two years. Many residents are fed up, but at the Southwest community meeting, some people told Fox 5 they are actually more focused and concerned about other issues. I don't feel like any um, major metropolitan uh, city could actually be considered, you know, always safe. You will always have to look, look out for your best interests and make sure that you're traveling as safe as possible. But I will say that I was impressed by um, um, the police chief saying that though we feel like there's been an increase in crime here in southwest D.C., it's actually decreased, so the numbers have actually gone down here. I also asked Mayor Muriel Bowser about her former chief of staff and D.C. Deputy Mayor John Falchicchio. She said any questions about the allegations he's facing of sexual harassment need to go to her office of legal counsel. However, I followed up and said, are you surprised by these accusations? And again, she referred me to her office of legal counsel. Back to you.